next thing you know, you, you end up on Wild and Out and all of that. So, mm-hmm. like, how was that journey getting to Wild and Out? And then everything else after that, or but well, you probably did a whole bunch of stuff before that. Yeah. Like, that you written, like, who have you written for that people are like, what the hell? I didn't know that. Um, I'm trying to just think. I won't name comedians. I can name like uh, show, I say shows. shows. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Dwayne Wade on the Cube. Okay. It's the number one game show that's out right now. Mm. Um, uh, uh, BT Awards and Hip Hop Awards. So I do remember that one. And the uh, Social Media Awards. So I should be credited with creating the Karen because we did it on 2017 Hip Hop. I mean, uh, Social Media Awards with Jess, Jess Hilarious and DC Young Fly. Yeah. Um, then. Duval did a hip hop awards. Um, Taraji P. Henson wrote for her on the uh, awards, BT Awards. Yeah. And a slew of your favorite comedians, you know, for their stand up and whatnot. And the way I write is I, I sit I stand on the side and I watch your set and I just take some take notes. Okay. You know what I mean? Nice. I, I don't I don't really give people jokes per yeah. se because I don't know if I don't know. I mean unless you're like I see you're super talking. famous and I already know your set already and I know what you talk about and I can Got just you. slide some stuff in there. But if you know I don't really get to see you in the club type shit. Yeah. And you working on new stuff, I I I punch up and then even do some links. You know what I mean? Okay, some joke links, like yeah, this is how you should, could get to the next one. So okay. done that for a lot of, a lot of different comedians, man. You know, writing for myself, man. Every every project I usually get involved with, I kind of get into the writing part of it. So that's how I got on Wild and Out. Okay. Because uh, I auditioned a couple times and, and and you know didn't make it, but I did my thing in the audition, like. So it was it was, kind of, it was a political situation, you know. I didn't have that many, I guess, followers or you know some yeah, people. I always, it always do that, man. Yeah, some people was getting on it and just need to get on it, and you know, it, it was what it was. My timing was gonna be my timing, but I I, I uh, volunteered to write when they came to Atlanta the first season, mm-hmm. and I volunteered to help out with you know with games and you know writing for the celebs and all. That. And it was like, well, you know, you did do your thing. Come on, you know, come on in and write. Be on the staff. Got in there, got in there, started doing some games and workshops, started killing it. It was like, well, we're going to put you on the cast, too. So it kind of just, it was that's just going so from volunteering to when you get your moment showing up. And that's the long, the, the short, short, short version of how I got on Wild It Out. Yeah. Damn, that's that's crazy. What did you do? Did you did you have, like, when, when you got that first, like, signed whatever contract you got signed to get on whatever? Mm-hmm. Like, how did you feel? Did you cry? Did you go celebrate? I had zero. I ain't had no time. Oh. I signed that contract like t- ten minutes before I got on stage my first time a while now, because it was a it was a back and forth. I was on a show called Boss Up on Wee TV. I do. At oh, the okay. same <laughs> time, my very first season it was season twelve. It was it was concurrent. It both started in the summer, so my contract had took a little doing to do. Mm-hmm. Um, was Wee TV had some things in mind. They were like, "We're gonna make you a star. We don't want you to be on this show." And the, the people thinking. You're wildin' out and not this show. And oh, the bullshit, got it. Man, that show got canceled. Fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> so, so they had some back and forth, and then, um, you know, I, I literally signed it um, in the dressing room and um, went on stage. So I didn't, I didn't have time to feel. It, but the feeling yeah. was already there. Nigga, I already got on. I got my mom, Vicky's son. I got my name on my wildin' out shirt. I got the hat on. You know what I'm saying? That shit like, gotta be great. Yeah, feeling, I already bro. filmed my 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 walkout intro thing when they say your name and the video shit I already did all that by the time I signed my contract so yeah it was it was it was surreal but it was it was it was good work I was ready to get to it and, and show my shit yo Ferg what up